Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Happy Chew Tuesday. Coming at you with some 2023 Panini National Treasures Baseball. Pick your team 13, all four boxes. A lot of great stuff here. So let's get on it. Um, we do have another case. Let me just handle my camera here just for a second here. I want to set the focus at a certain range. Um, we do have another case loaded up. So if you enjoy this... Uh, you enjoy this product there is another case loaded up so if you miss out on your teams the first time don't miss out next time all right so here's pick your team 13 here on a Tuesday so big thanks everybody here for making it happen Jervon with the Mets last spot mojo star next to your name and uh, if you see RNB right there that means random number block we pulled the remaining straggling teams and we turn it into a serial number break so there are the results right there we did that in a different video so good luck set that aside on right here get a little caffeine and let's pop this nt case open let's see what we got good luck everybody The exclusive doesn't explain how it's given away. Pretty easy. You just buy a team, and you're and you have an entry. So you can even buy whatever the cheapest team that's remaining out there. You grab that, and then you get a shot at at the expo and Tom Brady, that Bowman draft break. All right, there it is, 2023 NT Baseball. NT is always nice. Let's start off with a, with a book on top. Empty box on the bottom. the brightness a little bit. You can roll off the brightness of the teats. Because you're too washed out. We'll try that for now. And I'm going to use this uh, blank card right here to slow play some of the hits. So we're going to start off with a book and it's Harold Baines. 59 out of 99 legendary materials. Nice. A little bit of the lumber in there, which is pretty cool. Game use material. The shop is in Hermosa Beach, California. We've got someone on Twitch here checking in. White Sox, that'll be for Steve. Steve B with the White Sox. And the best card I ever pulled. I don't know, I did pull a 50 auto book, which was pretty awesome. That's on our YouTube channel if you want to check it out. We got Kevin Parada, 41 out of 49, piece of the jersey. A little bit of a ding on that bottom there, but that'll go to the uh, Mets. And that will be for, for Jervon Gates. And we got another relic here, Kyle Manzardo, 44 out of 49 piece of the jersey. It's going to go to Kevin M and the uh, Rays. we got retro materials. Bob Turley for the Yankees. 55 out of 99. You see the pinstripes there from an old-timers game. It'll be for Matt. These go in 75s? Or these can actually go into 75-point top loaders. These really thin ones here. Then we've got Aramis Ramirez. Rami. Five out of 99. Pirates. Another one for Kevin. So 130 or does this need a 180? This is going to be more comfortable than a 180. An assortment of toddler size is needed for an NT box. 
Game worn. And we've got Mark Pryor. Nice. 88 out of 99. For the Cubbies, it's going to go to John. John G. He's the current uh, Dodgers pitching coach. I have a couple new pitchers. To coach. We got Nick Gonzalez, jersey and autograph. 27 out of 99. Another one for Kevin and the Pirates. And we've got Scott Rowland, nice, on the hot corner. 55 out of 99. Cardinals edition. Cardinals are a number block team. So if you're not familiar with the uh, random number block format, we, we don't really care about the, what's on that side right there. We care, and we don't care about that, for, that digit over there. We care about that digit right there, five. Just directly to the left of the slash. And that's gonna be Eugene with the number five, that extra spot coming in handy. And the last one here, ooh, nice. Ellie Dela Cruz, 18 out of 25, electric Ellie. Nice patch in there as well. And that's Michael. Michael A. picked up the Reds straight up. Got an on-card auto there as well. Very cool. All right, nice start. That's our first box. Box two. I feel like it's been a little quiet baseball wise. Oh, no, not quiet. Looks like uh, the Cubs ended up with Shoto Imanaga. This one, the sticker's on this side here. I don't know what that means. There you go, MLB trade rumors. Bob Nightingale reporting that. Just right now, I think. Yeah, according to Bob Nightingale, about just a few minutes ago, just be. 3.58 West Coast time. It's 4.05 right now. Chicago Cubs have reached a tentative deal with Japanese pitcher Shoto Imanaga. They'll undergo a physical in Chicago on Thursday before the deal becomes official. Let's see what the numbers are going to be. I feel like the Cubs have struggled a little bit trying to get free agent talent there, so maybe they're... Maybe that's who they're going to chase after. Right? They're going to lose the service. They've lost the services of Stroman already, right? I think he ended up opting out. All right, onwards. Box two. Good luck. There's James Wood. 21 out of 99. Jersey and auto. Nice. Ooh, piece of candy. Raymond with the Nats. And we got Kyle Harrison, 25 out of 49, biography materials for the Giants. That will go to Thomas M. Ooh, look at that patch. Brandon fought. Two out of 10. Nice. What a run by the Diamondbacks last year. Should be a should be a fun fun season in the NL West. Nice Isaac got the Diamondback straight up. Very cool. Then we've got uh, Tris Speaker highlighting his 792 doubles 
One out of 99. Boston, Karen. We got Retro Materials, Dom DiMaggio, also for Karen and the Red Sox. And a train whistle, Karen. Out of five and under, gets the world famous. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. I like that. Game worn, game used material for these old school players. It's always, always cool to see. And we got Taj Bradley, 35 out of 99. A bit of the uh, Rays logo peeking out there. That's a cool looking one for Kevin and the Rays. And we got Gavin Stone, ace, 98 out of 99 for the Dodgers. Nice one for David M. and the Dodgers. I think, uh, Gavin, Stone, Gavin Stone could be a, a trade candidate if the Dodgers want to add more experienced pitching. Otherwise, he might find himself in the back of this rotation. Got some good stuff. All right, we got Rafael Palmero for the Rangers. Nine out of 25. That'll be for James. Jim has Texas. Great mustache on, on Palmero. We got a rookie auto, Jace Young. Josh's brother, 55 out of 99. <laughs> I do, Eric. I, I I use those in our in our tweets. The old the old steam train. That's the exact kind of train I think of when I do the train whistle. This is for Mike S and the Tigers. Last one here, nice, Jason Dominguez, 23 out of 25. Two color jersey and on card auto. He had a really nice uh, debut. I think he went down with an injury. Hopefully he'll be back sooner rather than later. Uh, but Matt and the Yankees, very nice. All right, another box down, we're halfway through. Speaking of Twitter, folks, follow us on Twitter at Jaspie's Breaks. We have some. Uh, we have a couple polls. Uh, a couple polls up. Curious about what what everyone's uh, wild card matchups thoughts are. Here's another one with the stickers right there. So I posted the uh, the poll for Saturday's games, and that's gonna that'll end a little bit later tonight. So if you want to voice your opinion via a Twitter poll, or X poll, I guess, now. And head over there, click the link in the chat, or just go search at uh, Jaspie's Breaks, Jaspie's Breaks on, or on Instagram too, and social media. All right, book on top, seven out of 10, Jimmy Fox for Philadelphia. Nice, uh, nice dual relic right there. Old pieces of his lumber. Game worn used material. Wow. I want to say it's about turning into time where we'll be uh, looking for, you know, where the baseball season's coming back around. You start to rewatch some old baseball movies. I want to say Jimmy Dugan. Jimmy Dugan in a, a League of Their Own um, is based off of Jimmy Fox. Phillies. Uh, Chung with that one, with the Phillies. Ah, looks like Dominguez will be back in July. Well, that's good. There's Red Show Nice, 28 out of 49 for the Cardinals. Cardinals are a number block team, and that'll go to John and St. Louis, 8. Uh, 
Uh, that goes to uh, John. You're right. Jag, I was just making sure that you were paying attention. It's old Philadelphia A, Jimmy Fox. Were the, were, were this, was this the old, uh... Yeah, the old Philadelphia A's. I want to say, I wonder, if, did Jimmy Fox play in the Connie Mack era? I'm not sure exactly when he played. Philadelphia A's from 25 to 35. No, Connie Mack, uh... He had owned the team from 01 to 1954. All right, Joe Mauer, five out of ten, piece of his lumber. Twins. That's going to go to Chris. Chris Parent for that one. Oh, by the way, the A's are a random number block team. So, sorry, Chung, with the Phillies, but I made a mistake. It's actually the Philadelphia A's old school Jimmy Fox, but that's 7 out of 10. That's going to go to John in the number 7. Bobby Wood Jr., Retro Materials, 1 out of 99. Are the Royals going to be a low-key good team next year? You know, it's another year of experience under his belt. You know, they've got some, some fun youngsters on that team. Might be more competitive than people think. Well, there's Elijah Green, three-color patch and auto, nine out of 25 for Raymond in the Nationals. And we got a Jacob Berry. Triple Relic and Autograph, 61 out of 99 for the Fish. That's going to be for Ryan and the Miami Marlins. This might have pretty thick card stock on this. It's going to fit into a 180 nicely. I don't think he did. Because I wasn't around during Christmas. I, I took, uh, took a little bit of a winter break. Here's Tyler Soderstrom. 10 out of 25, Oakland A's. Nice patch there, nice on-card autograph. Number zero, Eugene with zero. Color wheels are always nice, though. We got a, a, a Jack Leiter, 28 out of 49. Is Jack Leiter going to be... Getting some major league action this year? Or is he still, I don't know where he's at. Supposed to be really good. Second overall pick by the Rangers in 2021. And I think he went to college, right? Yeah, so he might be, he might be, no, not close. Is right, we'll see. Oh, I see. He struggled in 2023. Two months out of game action on the develop, development list. I'm looking at his Wikipedia. You're right. With Frisco, uh, the double-A team, he went 2-6 and six with a 5.06 ERA. Strikeouts looks good, but then finished the 2023 season with a start in triple-A. Uh, but yeah, there is some definitely some regression. So, well, we'll see. I'll hope for the best. Jim with the Rangers. We got a redemption. It is Jackson Churio, the future. That's uh, Brewers. His brother Jason is with Cleveland. Brewers are a random number block team, so this goes to zero, and that's going to be for Eugene.
All right. And the last one here is Tamar Johnson, 23 out of 99. Three color patch and autograph for Kevin M. Pirates. Nice one for the Buckos. All right. Final box coming up. We got another case loaded up too for another fresh case. So if you miss out on your teams the first time, don't miss out this time. This is pick your team 13. Pick your team 14 on jazbeescasebreaks.com. Get them before someone else does. All right, another thick box, another one with a sticker over the thumb notches. Ooh, I haven't seen this book yet. Looks kind of cool. Felt like there was a card still stuck in there, but empty box. And let's flip that over. We got Future Fame, America's Pastime book. All right, here we go. 103 out of 150. It is Ellie Dela Cruz. Nice. Nice on card autograph, big plain patch. Still really cool. Another one from Michael A. and the Red Legs. We've got a big jumbo patch here. Looks nice. Francisco Alvarez. One out of ten. That's a cool one. That's going to be for Gervon and the Mets. Thirty, right? There we go. It's a cool looking patch. We got a Jordan Lawler, one out of ten. Piece of the jersey for Arizona. Isaac for that one. Someday, Eric. Someday. Got Tony Gwynn, nice, 17 out of 19. Just a couple off the jersey number, but for a nice one for the Padres, that'll go to Todd. And we've got another Ellie De La Cruz. Nice patch right there, a lot of color in that small window. Two out of 25. Michael. got Chris Mead, 12 out of 49, two color patch and autograph for Kevin and the Rays. And we've got Bubba Chandler, nine out of 49, three color patch on card autograph, another one for Kevin and the Pirates. Back to back, he's heating up, he's on fire. All right, a few more to go. Good luck, everybody. There's Jackson Job, 46 out of 49, two color patch and autograph. For Detroit, Mike S. Second to last card is gonna be Brennan Davis, 36 out of 99. Nice patch, nice auto. Good penmanship, that's gonna be for John and the Cubs. Nice color in the patch too, always like that. And the last one here is gonna be, nice, Colton Kowser, another nice looking patch, 55 out of 99. The Orioles are a number block team, that's gonna to go to the number five, Eugene, with Orioles five. Nice stuff, ladies and gentlemen, we got more in the store. Check it out, grab your teams, jazbeescasebreaks.com. No randomizers to do here at the end. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next NT break. Bye-bye.